You know, the previous government, they got some things wrong. A lot of things wrong. But they did get some things right. Tito Mwing, Governor of the Reserve Bank, Mr. Trevor Manuel. I look up, left, right, down, and I ask myself, where is Trevor Manuel? I mean, these people, they, they did their part. I mean, the government had a lot of problems and malfunctions and corruption and, you know, all these problems. But they delivered. They did the best they could for this country. There's a fallout, you know, the, the 700 billion financial crisis that we're in right now because of banks in the western parts of the world. We here in South Africa, we stand because of these two people. And I'm asking myself, you know, Mr. Trevor Mandel is such a great minister. I mean, whenever we in trouble, South Africa's crying, we run to him. Please help us. Please cut tax. Please give us this. What's the way forward? Give us a vision. You know, this, this, this is a guy that actually, when I look at him, I see, wow. Wow. This is what I'm talking about, about South Africa. Why aren't we duplicating people like Trevor Manuel. That's what I'm asking. So these are the leaders. That, that, that's a guy that you cannot help but admire. I mean, what he's done is, it's amazing. But the funny thing is, I read in the papers, they say, actually, whenever I read, I don't see his name being mentioned. Where is he in all of this? He's not even been considered for presidency, if I'm right. Yeah, he's not even a candidate. This is the person that runs the whole fin our whole financial sector, and he's done it so well. He's been doing it for years. He's got experience in this whole thing. I mean, if you can run finance, and you know, you can deliver, you show leadership. I mean, you run it to the to the last detail with his team and his group of people, and they, you know, I think they did, they did a good job. They did the best that they could. They did the best they could, but he's got the skills and we don't even look at him. No. We don't even consider Mr. Trevor Man. <laughs> it's so funny because you know some things are just so simple. Right? Trevor Manuel says, you know what, I, I no longer agree with the situation with the ANC and the way things are happening. I'm gonna just leave or you know, just Rather step down. Ran depreciates, loses value. Foreign investors, people outside that are looking and watching it, say, oh my gosh, what is going to become of South Africa now that the person that's holding it together is no longer there? <laughs> President Zuma does the same thing. Not that he's a bad guy or anything, but nothing's going to happen. We just, oh, okay, fine. There we go. Yeah, he left. I don't understand how we in this very country can't see that the guy that's supposed to be sitting in the chair is not even being considered. The guy that's supposed to be taking us to this level is not even being considered. Doesn't make sense. He, I thought when they pick him president, they pick him based on do you have the skills? Will you meet the requirements? You know, can you do the job? Are you the best fit? Well, our best fit is not even on the list. Just doesn't make sense to me. Just doesn't make sense to me. Maybe I'm crazy. Maybe I'm crazy. Maybe I'm crazy. Maybe, please. Maybe, maybe, maybe I'm just being irrational or I'm just... But I, I'm not understanding. Maybe you can explain to me. What's actually going on here? Trevor Manuel. I don't understand. You know, with every new change, it presents opportunity. This is the best time, I say, for you in South Africa. This is the best time. The time when we decide, you know what, this is where we want to go. These are the people, these are the options that we have. 
This is the best time because what we need right now is change. That, that's what we need right now. We need change. Change. And if I can smell it, it's in the air so much. It's, it, 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 yeah. The best time to be in South Africa. It's uncertain. But oh, the, the, that means that we have to look at our books, go back to the drawing boards and say, you know what, they've done this, they've done that. Let's not look at making a change. Let's try get what will be best for us. And it's the best time to be in South Africa, I say. Because this is it. This is where we're going to cut off and, you know, change our, the rest of our lives or not do anything about it and just let it happen. Let South Africa go to the dogs. If it goes to the dogs, let South Africa go down the hole. If it goes down the hole. Or we can say, not no. This is my home. I'm going to stand up. I'm going to fight. I'm going to make sure South Africa goes to where it needs to go. And I'm going to be a part of that. That's what's so beautiful about it. You and I have that opportunity. Let's do it. Nothing's stopping us. Let's just go for it. <laughs> we can. I know we can. <laughs>